again. Um, it's me. I actually made it to Misawa at this point, and I am now in a hotel of sorts. Those who know exactly who I work for would know exactly the sort of accommodations I'm in at the moment. But needless to say, as you can see from the couch and love seat that I'm more couch and chair that I have access to. This is actually a pretty spacious, nice accommodation, and this is just until I can actually get my own my own place, either an apartment or a small house. Um, <clears throat> one thing I wanted to mention a little bit, some people probably already know that Japan, people actually drive on the other side of the road as opposed to the United States. They drive to the left. Uh, I didn't realize how much, how awkward that is until I actually got here. I mean, you can, that's one of those things, you can prepare for it all you want, but until you actually get here and you're actually having to get in on the opposite side of the vehicle, driving the wrong side of the road, um, even pedestrian traffic, if you're walking into a building, you enter through the left door, uh, not the right one as opposed to the way you would in the United States. You don't really think about this, but honestly, it's really ingrained into our heads, this this idea of traffic flow to the left. And I must say, it's something that's taking a lot of getting used to. Uh, there's already been one or two times where I've been sitting in the car, somebody's been driving, and I swear we've, we're about to get into an accident because the guy is turning and it, uh, there's somebody coming in from an oncoming lane, and I'm expecting to go into the the right hand lane, which is where this other car is, and you know, bam. Uh, but of course, you know, we're just fine. It's just me freaking out for no reason. Uh, not to mention riding in a vehicle on the passenger side, which is actually the left side, which uh, most of you realize in the United States, passengers go on the right side, and that's also really unnerving being on what should be the driver's side of the car and having no control of the vehicle uh definitely definitely something to get used to uh and of course again the pedestrian traffic um you get so used to having a wall to your right that it almost it's almost like a comfort thing that you want to have that that wall to your right uh all of a sudden, now you're on the left, your right-hand side's exposed, and it's really unnerving. Um, I would say try it in the States, but you, if you try this in the States, obviously you'd start running into people because everybody moves to the right. But if you ever have to consistently uh, travel on the left-hand side, it's just, it goes against all everything that you've been taught when you are growing up, so... It's just kind of a, a glimpse into what it's like. Um, but again, it's just one of those things, someone could explain it to you a thousand times until you actually do it, you really don't even realize. Anyway, that's all for today. Um, I'll have probably another topic or two over the next couple of days, uh, hopefully going into the actual city of Misawa tomorrow with some friends, check out the mall, check out some of the uh, local food stores uh, really want to get into some of that Japanese cuisine anyway see you guys later sayonara